You may be one day able to walk around parts of downtown Warren carrying an adult beverage. Council talked about it earlier this evening, and 27 First News reporter Tyler Trill was there for the discussion. Tyler joins us live in the studio with our top story at 11. Well, Stan and Manny, Ohio law lets people drink alcohol in designated areas of an entertainment district. Warren established their entertainment district a few years ago, but have yet to move forward on open containers. Paul Clouser lives in downtown Warren. He says the open container law is a good idea, but it needs to be tightly regulated. It should be permitted specifically for an event with a start time and an end time. The designation would be a specific cup, whether it be a red solo cup or whatever, along with a wristband. The open container law would only be for the city's entertainment district, which is along Market Street and includes the area by Courthouse Square. One idea that was discussed was allowing people to drink outside of a beer tent at downtown events, like the Italian Fest. But everyone at the meeting did not believe a 24-7 open container law would be good. We would have to craft a specific piece of legislation. We, I don't believe there's anybody who would just say, yeah, open container. Councilman John Brown brought a concern of police regulation. And how do you determine a legitimate uh, person downtown with a, a craft beer from somewhere? Uh, versus someone that's taking advantage of the system. The police chief was not at tonight's meeting. The Lime Tree is one business that holds a liquor license in the entertainment district. One of the owners tells me she thinks the law would help them grow, but does not believe it should be for all hours of the day. Now, no vote happened tonight or was even scheduled. Most of council says they need to discuss legislation amongst themselves and the people of Warren before taking action. From the studio tonight, Tyler Troll, 27 First News at 11.